Hi everyone and welcome back to another Metroid 2 Remake. Last time we've gone through the industrial complex, covered most of the area, missed a few spots but there should be nothing there. Now we're going to be covering the rest of the area above it and hopefully destroying all of the Metroids left. There's six left. Hmm. I'm going to start with here. Should be a Metroid or a power up here. Uh, oh, I need power bombs? <laughs> Well, that's disappointing. I wasn't expecting to be blocked off so early, but fair enough. I doubt we'll be getting power bombs anytime soon. I expect them for to be given to us next area. Hmm. Figured there would be something in this thing right here, but it's just for show, I guess. If there was something, the minimap would be spoiling it for us. Yeah, this is much easier than climbing with the spider ball, isn't it? Anything here? Secret passage? No, nothing. There was a certain spot in Super Metroid where there was a secret passage that you could go through. And this is the most infuriating part about that passage. If you were going to use the scan visor on it, it would not reveal the passage as invisible. For, for some reason. And that was just aggravating because for the longest of times, I never knew that I could go through there. Ugh. When I found out that I could go through there, it was like, Ugh, what have I done with my life? Could have gotten 100% Super Metroid for so long, and yet I didn't know about this stuff. Oh. Yeah, Shine Spark. Was this there before? I don't think so. Uh, but I don't have the space to do this. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to get a charge somewhere. Or was it from here? No. It has to be new, cause that. Huh. Well, whatever's going on right now, this game, the game wants me to stay here. That's for sure. I guess I'm gonna have to get rid of all these enemies if I want to have the space to be able to do speed booster. I doubt the game wants us to do something so difficult right now. So that's why I suspect that what I'm doing right now is uh, not intentional. Go right through here and if I do it properly, I should be able to continue with the game. But I highly doubt it's intentional. Yes! Yeah, like this. So, again, I doubt this is intentional, unless I just don't remember how I got here, but... Yeah, I still feel weird. I still feel guilty. Um, this is super missiles, right? Yeah. Okay, let's do this. Blow up! What's behind you? Mm-hmm. Some puzzle for a missile expansion. This thing again. I still don't know what it's for. So, if you guys know what it's for and you've already told me in a previous video, well, I still don't know what it is, fortunately. I definitely need to activate this thing in order to go through this door. There was a similar door in the um, breeding grounds or in the previous area, the Hydro City, whatever that place is. And there's also that passage right over here that I need the power bombs for. Huh. There's gonna be lots of backtracking. And not how Metroid 2 did it. Oh, seriously? I need to use super missiles to get out? I could potentially get stuck forever in there. Anyway, can I go through here? No, I cannot. But I can go through here. And I should be able to go down there. Okay. What can I do while down here? This area is creepy. Very creepy. <gasps> yep, yeah, obviously there's going to be a Metroid. Ah! Come on. Yay! Even Gamma's 
are weak against that strategy. Just stick in one spot where they cannot go under you from an angle, a diagonal angle, and you can do a lot of damage on them. Huh. Well, it's a new area. I, I, I kind of doubt I'll be able to find all the Metroids here. I might have missed something back in the previous area. Because I feel like I'm <laughs> using techniques way too expert for this game right now. Also, this is a return spot. Careful. Or wait, 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 wait. No, it's going to still be stuck down there. And I can always use the Shine Spark to go there. Yeah. Yeah, it would not have been that difficult. I also wanted to check over to the left. Like, there's lava, but there's that power-up I wasn't able to find. I think I might be able to find it thanks to the Shine Spark now. I keep... Every time, I keep calling the Speed Booster the Shine Spark. Like, everyone... I assume everyone knows what I'm talking about, but it still kind of bothers me. This area is very creepy, by the way. Nice job, level maker. I mean, <laughs> level maker. This is not Mario Maker. Oh, also, yeah, there's a Metroid right here. Very hard to see. And, unfortunately, it's going to be a little difficult for me to take care of it. Ah, it's grabbed me! No! Ah! I can do that. Creepy thing. So, I guess when it charges me, it's actually trying to grab me, maybe? Maybe. Come on. You does it restore its health when it absorbs my energy? Maybe. Ow. There. Huh. That was freaky. Very well designed, though. That's the, that's the intention for an area like this. Purposely limiting uh, your sight. C considering this is a 2D game, uh, logically, Simon should be able to see much more ahead of her, but it's 2D, so... You can only see, like, in a small circle of light around the character. Hmm. Another Metroid down here. There's still gonna be three left, even after I destroyed this one, however. Oh, wow, it's so dark. Hmm. It's probably down here, but... Let's switch around here a bit more. Is there a name for this place? Hmm, I guess not. Rooting Grounds too, I guess. Anyway. Where are you? Yeah. Haha, <laughs> you missed. I'm missing too, but I've got lots of ammo to spare. Come on. I can tank so many hits. Ah. I'm <laughs> oh no! You. Uh. Oh, not again! Stop grabbing me! Okay, so it does not restore its health. And there's n n not another one, fortunately. Oh, but the it continues? Uh, I don't know if I should be doing this. I can always run away, whatever the case. Ow. Oh, those things hurt? Huh. Save point? Huh, I really could use a save point right now. Come on. Destroy these things. Okay, this is destructible. Any speed booster tiles somewhere? Hmm. Go through here. I might have missed, like, a visor, maybe? Because this area is really, really dark. Also, whenever there's enemies in the area, that means that pretty much guarantees that there's not going to be a Metroid. Logically. Oh, supers. Can really use those. After uh, here? Yep. Just need to have supers. Already, so I can get those. Just need to make sure I'm aiming properly. There we go. Gimme supers. No, yeah. 
Oh, I need Shine Spark? Really? Huh. How could I possibly do Shine Spark from here? Well, I've destroyed these blocks and they're not coming back, so now I guess I have the room for it. Yeah, I can build it right here. Okay, N not so bad. It's really dark though, so it's hard to see. Now that I have four super missiles, I might be able to use one on a Metroid, but I'm not sure if that would be a good idea in a way. Hmm. Continues here. Come on. Yeah, right here. Not a Metroid? Probably. Huh. Okay, right here. Bomb. Ah, I keep hitting those things. So frustrating. Kind of intentional from the game, too. Did, uh, come on. Oh, wow. I'm stuck down here now. Except I can escape through here. Oh, yeah. It is kind of intentional to keep getting me stuck. Uh, what? Guess I'm supposed to use Spring Ball for this place? Yeah. Probably not intentional, but... Got here. Metroid? Yep. There's a Metroid over here. Uh, wait. Oh! There's a passage! A shaft. Huh. That leads to all the way over here and... Yeah, it's a shortcut. Cool. Should have found this a lot earlier. Okay, so I'm a bit low on health, but let me try to destroy this extra Metroid. Come on. Where are you? Oh, come on. Stupid things. Come on. Oh, what? Did I already use my supers? How, how come? Come on. Yeah, that wasn't too tough because uh, I wasted my supers nonsensically right there, but... I still don't like fighting these Metroids. I, I think that's all of them for this area, however. Gone to the depths of it. That leads me to wonder where the other ones are, however. Huh. I guess I'm gonna have to go back to the industrial complex. Sorry if I was a little quiet for this place, by the way, but it's completely new. Definitely not a Metroid 2 original. Very, very good, though. Creepy and atmospheric. And challenging. I'll just use a secret shaft. Oh my goodness, I better not have to face... Uh, uh, Zeta Metroid going out of here. That would be really, really bad. Well, I could always run away. I did the same thing the first time I had to face a Gamma. It's not insanely dark anymore. Uh, get me out of here. Phew, save point. Game saved, can continue from here. But it's only been 19 minutes, so I'm going to continue and try to find the last two Metroids if I can. Definitely not supposed to go through here, by the way. Uh, in fact, the game is blocking, off, blocking me off already. Unlike Metroid 2, which only blocked you off at the very end. That's fine, I guess. Uh, the game's explanation, by the way, is that uh, the reason why there's so many earthquakes is because uh, the area we're in is near tectonic plates. 
What's what's the word for it? I want to check just to be sure. Earthquakes. Tectonic plates. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Yeah. For this area, I still can't really do much, unfortunately. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll mention the one thing right now. I don't really like the remix of the original uh, SR388 team right here. It's underwhelming, basically. Because I, I replayed Metroid 2 a while ago, just for a moment, and the original team was really significantly more upbeat. I get that they were pro probably trying to be atmospheric, and the Game Boy was really limited in its... Uh, sound uh, bites, <laughs> but uh, I don't know. I still like the original team better. Limitations and all. Okay, so I went under. That's what I did originally. Fair enough. Hmm. There's not gonna be space pirates at some point, is there? There's gonna be space pirates at some point. Ridley and Kratos are going to come in, and that's where I'll be getting the power bombs for, from, right? Ugh. Zero Mission did the same thing, and I liked it then, but it feel kind of uh, cliched if it, this game made that, uh, chose to go down that road as well, you know? Well, I don't, don't really know where to go right now. Hmm. I guess I'll have to search down the, back in the industrial complex again because I really might have missed something there okay cannot speed booster through this debris just wanted to make sure and there was nothing in this lava all along what a surprise Huh, that, that leaves me with nowhere to really search right now, however. I guess it's time for some backtracking into, like, the previous areas. Wow, those spikes only deal four damage. Huh. Guess they really aren't that dangerous after all. Hmm. Okay, so this platform right here... It's for charging up your speed booster if you want. Which you can use over here. To probably continue with this area. Well, I mean, it's power bombs, but maybe speed booster works as well? Or maybe you have to use a combination. Yeah, it's probably a combination. Like, I have to use power bombs here, but probably the speed booster afterwards. Like, almost immediately afterwards. I guess this area is for uh, some really complex uh, expansion. Yeah, like a missile tank. <laughs> or maybe a beam combo. That'd be interesting. Beam combos. I don't know exactly how it would work, but, you know, it'd be interesting. Oh! Oh. It's just a shortcut, but, uh. Hmm. Interesting applications. Oh, it's in case you're stuck, okay. That's, that's what it's for, because you need supers to get out, you know? Ah, there it is! That's where it was the entire time, because there's no spikes in this spot right here. Yeah, in case you got, thought you could continue by here, no. It's blocked off as well. Um. So come on, Samus, please. Can you wall jump underwater? Yes, you can. Well, it's not water, but liquid. Under liquid. <laughs> mm, 
Okay, everyone. It's almost been an hour since I started this episode, and... I don't know. I don't know where I'm supposed to go to find those two Metroids. Like, there's two areas that I haven't completely searched uh, out yet, but I don't know how to continue with those areas, so... I would assume it's beyond the power bombs, but I don't know how to continue in that area. At least not yet. Maybe I didn't search hard enough. And if there's a secret area somewhere, I cannot see where it is. At least not now. So I'll continue this later. Hope you all enjoyed this video and hope you're having a stay. Next time we're going to seek out those last two Metroids and hopefully, well, probably continue with the game. Bye-bye. Uh,